So tell me more about the leadership retreat. When was it? What outcomes were you looking for? What challenges did you encounter? I just got back from the retreat. It was very successful and there were positive team outcomes. I am confident that I could replicate the same for your company, as this is not the first retreat for which I've been leader. And a challenge? It was difficult to get buy-in at first, but I have Myers-Briggs training, so I understand people and how they best work together in teams and as individuals. Great, thank you so much. Do you have any questions for me? Just one. What is the time frame for the final decision? You will hear from us within 10 days. We are vetting final candidates. Thank you so much for this opportunity to come in. I look forward to hearing from you. I think she would be perfect, actually. Her skills and interests align with our goals, and she will bring exceptional experience that we currently don't have on the team. She also strikes me as a very proactive and positive worker. I have to check her references, but first I want to do a quick virtual scan. Let's make sure we aren't hiring someone who is wanted for some crime. Let me Google her. She probably has a LinkedIn profile. Let's see if she has been endorsed for any special skills. Okay, no LinkedIn. Well, that's a little strange. But she does have a Twitter account. Let's see what she says and who she follows. Okay. Looks like she's pretty confident that she's getting this position. Well, looks like our search continues. Had this person been more vigilant about her online persona, she might in fact have had a new position. Perhaps in the future she will be more savvy about the connections between her personal life and her public social persona, and she will reflect on how she wishes to appear to others, most especially prospective employers. Where did she go wrong? 